my philosophy about bartending. If you have the opportunity to go out in the forest, picking new ingredients and really try to evolve the things you are doing, I think you should do it. And in the end, it will result in great cocktails. My name is Emil Reng. I work as a bar manager at Rex Bar and Grill in the northern part of Sweden in a town called Umeå. Foraging in Sweden is something you grew up with. When you, when you live in the northern part of Sweden, you live very close to the forest. The philosophy behind Rex and the cocktail list and how we try to work is work very close to nature and try to work as the chefs do, as terroir, the French word for local. And that's what we're trying to do in this bar too. Use ingredients that we have around the corner as cloudberries, birch bark, spruce. Try to have those things in cocktails and, and make it work. So we found some chanderelles and my idea with this is to use them maybe in a syrup or, or maybe do a quick infusion. You work as a bartender, you're supposed to sell something. You need to sell them that this is the best cocktail you will ever drink. And if you can do that, they will have a new experience. And if you can tell a story to it, they will always come back. We managed to find chanterelles, and uh, we took down some birch bark. Uh, we took some water from the creek, and we also managed to find some Lichen. I really wanted to make a cocktail that brings out the flavor of the Johnny Walker, because Johnny Walker, I think, is one of the best blended whiskeys in the world. I made a syrup of chanterelle, so I boiled it with sugar. And then I added some licorice, and the licorice is not so much for the flavor, but it really enhanced the flavor of the chanterelle, so it really goes well with the Johnny Walker. To balance it up, we use some port wine. So now we're gonna add the ice, and I work with ice in a totally different way. We take ice from the Torne Elv, and it's the same ice that they use in the ice hotel in Jukasjärvi. I'm gonna smoke it with the birch bark we found today. And I put the birch bark in a blender to really get the flavor out of it. This is a great cocktail when you have been out in the forest all day, coming back, you have a nice dinner, sit next to the fire and enjoy this excellent flip. So in the end, this is not things that everybody can do. But if you have the opportunity to do it, I think you should try it. Because the guests will get a new experience and you will evolve as a bartender. <laughs>